Hey, we're still on a budget, people. We are still on a budget, but somehow this ended up at the house. Irish cream liqueur, Kirkland brand. Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> Costco, thank you very much. No. I'm above this. I am above this. I just couldn't do it. True love coming through in the clutch. Man. He's going over to the neighbors right now. Bridget, that is. Go oh, chit chat. Go chit chat on the front porch. I love our neighborhood. Oh man. Boys are in the bath. I'm eating ice cream. I was good. Right, are the two little monkeys ready to get out of the bath? No, we're not. Two little monkeys. No. Yes. yes. Whoa! No, easy, no. easy, 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 easy. Yes, yes, I am a, uh, I'm a football fan. A lot of uh, distance runners are kind of put in this box as being like they can't really understand or come to a comprehension of other sports because running and distance running especially is so unique and so different because you don't have a ball, you don't have a puck, you, you don't have a, you know, a racket, you just go run. So it's, a, it's unique, it's different than a lot of other sports. But I happen to be a big sports junkie. I just am. I am. And I'm not afraid to admit it. So, tonight the Denver Broncos kick off the 2017 football season in Denver, Colorado. So I'm going to go over to uh, Mr. Troy's uh, new basement and watch on this beautiful big screen, about 20 times bigger than the current uh, screen that we have here at our house. And uh, the game is the latest starting game in Denver Broncos home game history, 8.20 p.m. Now, if you know me well, you know that I like to go to bed at about 8.20 p.m. So, this is pushing it. I'm pushing my limits, and it's only 7.27 p.m. right now. Oh, boy. But before I go, I'm going to give a shout-out to the comment of the week because it's Monday, and I want to get back into the right rhythm after kind of some craziness in the summer, get into the right rhythm of the comment of the week, and the comment of the week goes out to the best comment in the last seven days, and that goes out to Troy's wife, my sister, Sarah. Sarah, great job commenting. Sarah, you did it. You did it. So the comment uh, from Sarah goes like this on the vlog about Nolan's. She wrote, man, this was a tough one to watch. So proud of you and so grateful for the Hodak dedication, dedications on the mount, about, you know, for the mountains. We love you. I have many fond memories of my 14er days and I look forward to my next one. Reminded me of how I think Huron is the prettiest one to hike. Just awesome scenery. Nice work, brother, and thanks for coming home safe. Exclamation point, exclamation point. Amen, Sarah, you get the comment of the week. Good job. And uh, all right, I'm off out to uh, go drink a couple brewskis with Troy and cheer on the donkeys. Broncos win. Broncos win. Question of the day, who's your team? Who do you cheer for? If you're a football fan, maybe you're not. But who's your team? And, hey, why not? And why? Say beauty. Hard. Love each other. See you guys tomorrow. Hope you're doing well out there. Wherever you're at, wherever you're watching.